Hi everybody, morning. <laughs> Just a little update of what's been going on in the past few weeks because I have been quiet and I haven't really felt like filming because one, I've been super busy, it's been half term. I literally worked every single day of it and it was just absolutely draining. Um, not even because of the work, just because of a few personal things, but I won't go into that. It's all done now, but yeah, so it has been really hard. And also since I found out that that was actually my last half term in my current venue. So that is a really scary thought to think that actually my new role is creeping up on me and it's going to be in a completely new venue it's going to be a complete fresh start it's just completely daunting i feel like i've got no idea what i'm doing um and it's just gonna be a completely different environment completely different to what i've been through so yeah it's exciting but it's actually really sad that i'm leaving my team because i love them all dearly and a lot of them are very much my close friends I'm in two minds about it at the moment. It's still processing because I didn't expect to move. Uh, so I'm still processing that. I'm still trying to get through to that. But other than that, everything's dandy, everything's great. Driving lessons, um, they're actually going really well. It's actually making me really excited. I've now had two more since I first mentioned it. And I actually feel like I can drive a car now, which is really, it's quite scary. Cause I'm, it, like I said, I never thought I'd be able to drive a car. I never wanted to drive a car. So it's very much pushed me this year. This whole year is just a whirlwind. But I still have a long, long way to go. Um, Because I'm stalling like there's no tomorrow. But, you know, I'm getting there. I can actually turn left. Because anyone who knows me knows that I was struggling with that a little bit. don't know why, but I just couldn't steer left properly. I would always almost crash, which my instructor probably didn't appreciate but yeah so I am improving it's just so exciting because I can finally drive a car and I don't have to think about it as much so that is a positive we've had pancake day certainly with my friends I don't have work now until Sunday so I'm just chilling I'm just living my best life having that time to relax because I didn't have it during half time so I'm just gonna relax I'm gonna enjoy myself on Saturday I'm gonna go out for girl drinks which is fun I can't wait it's just nice to have a bit of a life again but it's actually really sad that <laughs> I'm not gonna have the same life as I had but it's also really exciting I'm currently waiting for Jacqueline Joss's in the style collection to drop at 12 which should be 12 because I got early access I can't wait for that because I'm gonna spend all my money on it Gal got a treat herself. I've been waiting for this collection for so long, ever since it was announced. I've been so excited for it. Guys, I'm not even kidding. Her collection is insane. The actual stress that I've just been in, I've just taken about almost half an hour trying to put my payment through. Turns out I forgot to put the fucking address in. Hi! Um, it's actually now Saturday. Um, I was going to pick up my parcel yesterday on Friday, but I decided to have a spontaneous trip to Exeter where I went to Ikea for the first time and I tried a Five Guys for the first time. So it was quite a good day. So my parcel could wait another day, but I am so excited to open it. It is coming back here, completely unopened. So this is my raw first impression i'm so excited oh my god first thing is this two-piece it's loungewear it's the we got the jack Rosser rose square neck long sleeve bodysuit and also the rose rib lounge called a jogger to match so i'm going to try this on um this is what i was excited for because i live in joggers i live in them um, especially for driving lessons and stuff, I need to be comfortable or else I can't concentrate. So, this is what I'm going to try it for. I'm going to try it on now. This is the first outfit. Um, it's the Jack Josser Rose ribbed bodysuit, square neck, and the matching joggers. They are comfy. 
I'm just so happy with it. It's so pretty. Love that. Yes, Jack Dosser. Yes. So the second thing I picked up, and I didn't go crazy, I only bought these two outfits. This here, I'm so excited. It's a black floral print t-shirt dress. Now this was in a lot of her promos. This was on a lot of her Instagram stories. Like just, it was everywhere, this dress. And it's a perfect like day to night dress. It's a perfect casual dress, but it's really pretty at the same time. Um, and this literally sold like, 800 or something in its first hour so this is really popular so i'm really lucky to even have got this but i'm so excited to try this on okay this is the second outfit and i am in love with this i'm actually gonna wear this today for our day drinks and girly drinks i think it's amazing for it's just literally just a normal t-shirt dress but you can actually dress it up or dress it down i love it Right, I'm going to show you what it looks like full length because I've put some heels on and I just think it looks so cute. Yeah, I've got some heels on with it. Oh, it's just so cute. I live in t-shirt dresses so this is amazing, especially in the summer. It's just, that's just so easy to throw on. But I love it. But... So that is all for this video. Um, it's a bit of a mashup of what I've been doing the past few days. Um, but yeah, I just really wanted it and I was so excited for this collection that I just needed to document it because I've waited so long for it, as I've said, um, I'm not going to go into it again. Um, but yeah, so I really hope you like this video. Um, I am hoping to film more, but I am aware that there are people that I know, people that I work with, they have discovered this channel. And some of them have not been the kindest about it, kindest about it. And yeah, it's just like, drew me back a bit. It hasn't made me feel like filming because I just feel like, oh, they're just gonna watch it and take the piss out of me. Um, but yeah, like they, they're just trying to be really vile and trying to be really cruel for no reason, just because it's, that's their kind of person they are. That's in their nature, but I can't change that. I'm just thinking, why should I have to go through that? This is my choice. This is my business. You don't have to watch it. You don't have to take the mick out of me. And it's people that actually should know better that do. So I'm not stupid. I know you've subscribed to me. I know the people who have liked things, disliked things. I'm not an idiot. So if you didn't watch, that would be great. Or if you just get opinions to yourself, not share it in your little Facebook groups, it's not okay. So, but other than that, I am hoping to film more. Um, I did feel really insecure for a while, but why should they dampen something that I actually really enjoy making and doing? So, hopefully I'll see you soon. So, bye.